Hello Virgos and welcome to your reading. I'm Healing with Aish and today I'm going to have a look at what messages Spirit has for you and this will be for any of my beautiful Virgos that have Virgo in their Sun, their Moon, their Rising or their Venus. However, if you have been drawn to this video then please you know, take this message as it resonates for you. There could be a message in here for you, even if you don't have Virgo in your placements. Um, you know, you may just be in your earth element right now, or you may be dealing with a Virgo. So welcome cross watchers. Of course, if you would like a personal, drop me an email and thank you for joining. Also come back. Um, normally I would do your readings every Thursday. However, I'm a bit late for you, Virgos. I am a bit late with doing your reading. This is the first reading um, on my channel for Virgos. I'm so excited to do Virgos. I am Virgo rising and I do have um, a few family members that are Virgos, a couple of friends that are Virgos. I do love Virgos and I've been, I've been called like is there's been something in me like in the back of my head like spirit has been saying like all week like hurry up and do virgo hurry up and do virgo hurry up and do virgo so before i even start this read um i have been getting messages for virgos i feel like there's a lot of you guys that may need to hear this message whichever message spirit is going to bring out i don't know um but i definitely feel as though happy birthday for before anything happy birthday virgo happy birthday if you your birthday um was you know previously like last week or the week before then happy birthday if your birthday's coming up turn up virgo turn up um i'm getting this feeling of forgotten so not that you are forgotten because how can you forget a virgo Ain't nobody can forget no Virgo. You guys bring so much blessing and light into so many people's lives. You guys are so caring and nurturing and just have the most beautiful energy. Um, you know, a lot of Virgos are quite sharp with their tongue sometimes and people can find you guys sometimes quite cutthroat, but you are the most caring people ever. Like if you have a Virgo friend or a Virgo family member or a partner that's a Virgo, um, if you're a Virgo yourself, you will know that if you need if you need a Virgo, they will be there. They will be there. Like, and I feel like a lot of people in your energy, Virgo, are not appreciating the value that you bring to the table because a lot of people may say, okay, well, what do you bring to the table? Listen, Virgo is the table. Virgo is the table. Like, honestly, I feel like I'm just getting this energy of people need to start putting some respect on your name. I don't know where that's come from but let's 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 tap into this reading let's see what spirit has for you i have already pre-shuffled um both of my tarot decks the three tarot decks i'll be using today for you we'll see what energy comes out um i have already cleansed the space cleansed myself cleansed this energy but i will also just give it another shuffle okay let's go let's go whoa already damn spirit the wheel of fortune okay good karma new things are um th the wheel is turning in oh my gosh so much is coming out already spirit at least let me get the message out page of swords you're going forward a lot of people have got their eyes on you now virgo virgo you're looking good as i said it's your birthday people are people are looking at you you've also got a couple of stalkers if those of you that are on social media <laughs> best believe your page is popping <laughs> your page is popping whether you know this or not but best believe people are looking at your page because something has changed within you virgo okay you've got a lot of good karma coming towards you in a new cycle i can see what else do we have for my beautiful virgos people are watching you keeping up with you i've got this um some of you guys this is not going to resonate for everyone but for some people you may be in i don't want to say the news but maybe like newspaper articles or something like that um or even you may just have a business that's out there and a lot of people um are tapping into you they're keeping up with you they're watching you you're being watched you have a few i don't want to say stalkers because i'm not getting stalker vibes i'm just getting like fans you could say fans of stalkers, but I'm not getting creepy vibes. I'm getting more, um, there's a lot of people that are admi admiring you at this time. I also have the eight of wands. Okay. And I have the eight of pentacles in reverse. I also have the hangman. Um, so a 
for you if you you may have had this energy in the past where you may have been feeling stuck you may have been waiting um on things to turn over this could have been in regards to your finances a lot of you guys could be what you could my virgos are hard workers you know you like things being in place but then i've also got the eight of swords here just to show you these cards let me show you that was the first card we got wheel of fortune i got the uh, page of swords eight of wands eight of pentacles in reverse and i've also got the hangman just so you can see these cards a little bit better um so yeah as i said i feel as though quite a few of you have been you know you've been on your shit virgo you've been working hard okay um i do have the eight of pentacles in reverse um which is telling me like i said you've been working hard but it tells me that you've been in high demand so it could have been a work situation i'm getting a work situation it could have um also just been with family like you've had a lot of responsibilities ah the two of ones in reverse yeah so it's just like um people are demanding too much of you some of people are too little of you but i'm really getting a lot of people are, you, some of you guys might have very demanding jobs some of you guys could work um i'm getting like in care so like maybe like in a hospital or um, a lot of you guys may have businesses that are very high demand very busy very busy like a lot of you guys may feel like you didn't ha you don't have much time for yourself um you know be careful not to be wasting your abilities in a job or a work area that you're unhappy with make sure that you uh, are working somewhere that you that is fulfilling your needs um and some of you guys may may have you know had this feeling like you just can't even see it at the, beyond the end of the week you know don't try not to burn out, Virgo. You are amazing. Learn to manage your time. Balance yourself out, okay? Definitely balance yourself out um, during this time. So I also have the Eight of Wands, which to me, um, I just want to find out a little bit more information about that because um, good things are coming. And I feel like it's because of this because of all this hard work you've put in and like i said a lot of you virgos have been working your ass off and i'm not just getting like from the last six months to the last year you guys have been working your ass off i'm getting uh, past covid so since uh, maybe since um the end of covid a lot of you guys have been uh, virgos you've been working hard before that but i feel like uh, since covid a lot of you guys you know since we've all come out now a lot of you guys have been working hard i've got some signs that have been partying hard i've got a lot of virgos that have been working hard okay and your blessings are about to come in this is something that you have to look forward to the eight of wands this tells me that great news is on the way potential journeys new beginnings new starts if you have uh, started a business or you've got a business um you know that's that's established this new things are coming you're going to have new ideas uh nine of wands in reverse okay um so definitely take just going back to this eight of wands definitely take that time out for yourself as well with that eight of pentacles you know make sure okay you've been putting a lot of work in but it is time for you some of you guys need a vacation if you've not been on a vacation even i'm getting like a two-day break even like a spa day just for yourself don't invite anyone just for yourself virgo you deserve this time out don't burn out do not burn out, okay? People need to see your true worth. Eight of what? Did I not say that at the beginning? I feel like a lot of people need to put respect on your name, Virgo. Put respect on your name. Eight of swords, uh, okay? Um, okay, so I've got the nine. I just want to go back to this. I got the nine of wands in reverse. Sorry, this card's a little bit... It's just because this is the old tarot deck of mine, but I do love it. Um, so that tells me, like I said, a lot of you guys be careful of being burnt out. It tells me that a lot of you guys could have been stressed. Um, this could have been in a relationship. I don't have any cups here. So this is for me, this reading that I'm getting is all about work right now. Work, work, work. You're in that earth energy. Um, a lot of you guys could be stressed. A lot of you guys are working hard. Like I said, you guys need a little bit of a break. Not too long because uh, things moving forward, my darling. I've got the seven of wands also popped out in reverse. So, you know, that's letting me know you need a little bit of time on your a little bit of time for yourself but like i said people need to put some fucking respect on your name like honestly i don't know my my language but i'm just feeling that put some fucking respect on my name they people can't keep up with you virgo even if they tried even if they tried like people could not walk in your shoes i'm getting that if people could walk in their shoes your shoes they will people will be kissing your feet like they think oh it comes so easy people see how hard you work like i said there was you have people that are watching you you have a lot of admirers so you may feel as though you know you have you do have some haters i'm not gonna lie you do have a haters quite a lot of haters <laughs> quite a lot of haters i ain't gonna lie some people that would that would love to see you fail fuck them <laughs> 
fuck them. You got people watching you. You got people waiting on your downfall. But there ain't gonna be no downfall. There ain't gonna be no downfall. Because as I said to you, you've got great things coming to you, Virgo. You got money coming, and everything that you've worked on, you are going to receive it. Every little thing. Well done, and congratulations, and fucking happy birthday. Fuck them. <laughs> I'm getting this. Fuck them energy. Okay, you may be feeling like no matter how hard you try, your hard work could not be possibly justified. So like I said, a lot of you guys have been working for quite a, you know, the reason why I said that's because I have the seven of wands in my birth. Like I said, a lot of you guys may have, may have been working for, for whatever your goal is, whether it's a job, whether it's a business, whether it's a creative idea, whether it's a project. A lot of you guys have put a lot of energy into this aspect of yourself, um, into this area. And a lot of you guys could be feeling stressed. You may be feeling like you're not reaching where you, you feel like you should have reached um, a particular goal by now baby is coming <laughs> don't worry it's coming okay don't worry save your strength like i said a lot of you guys be careful of burning out be careful of burning out good things are coming to you virgo people are gonna wish they never fucked with you let me tell you that people are gonna wish that they whoever whoever used to you know pissed you off or didn't believe in you didn't believe in your goals didn't believe that you could be where you are today or where you're about to reach they are going to be eating their words and i tell you that the eight of swords which came out shows me that there was some restriction okay which this goes back to you overthinking be careful not to overthink be careful to, of your um, negative thought patterns you know have clarity like i said a lot of you guys need a bit of time away a little break away if you've not been on holiday yet take some time out it's your birthday it's okay to have a couple of days off virgo reground yourself okay make sure you're getting your affirmations in make sure you're having your cleansing bath is and stay away from negativity stay away from people that no, that no longer serve you stay away from toxic relationships people are watching you though <laughs> let them watch let them watch let them talk let them say whatever they like because your blessings are coming in let let me tell you something great news is on its way this could be in eight weeks eight months uh, could possibly i even want to say eight years because i feel like uh, some of you virgos could be eight years but i ain't getting that at least in the next eight weeks you will definitely start to see things coming through virgo beautiful energy i love this let's go into your love life so that was all work okay so we know good things are coming in stay away from negative thought patterns um but let's go into your love life because of course we want to know going on with love like come on man right love also some of, uh, some of you guys may be unhappy in a job you may be unsatisfied right now just take that break out for you to um regenerate your thoughts regenerate your energy cleanse your energy and start again this is a great time for you to go on a new venture if you need to or even if i'm getting if, if especially those of you that have your own business this is a great time for you to have some time away get into nature and also you'll start receiving um some new ideas some creative ideas that you know you need that unique selling point what is different what is different about your business about your project find that unique selling point you know don't try copy the rest you don't need to copy the rest virgo you're different you're unique okay you are different and you're not forgotten about because they're watching even when people may not be giving you the kudos that you deserve best believe they're thinking about you okay best believe they're watching you a lot of you are keeping why are we still in this i asked for love a lot of you guys okay this could be to do with love though but i got two messages here a lot of you guys um okay a lot of you have got the four of pentacles. This is why uh, I'm talking about this right now. A lot of you guys are keeping yourself to yourself in, in regards to love. I did ask about love. A lot of you guys are, um, some of you guys may have been hurt in the past. A lot of you guys, Virgos, you're very giving, you're very nurturing. I feel like you are trying to put all that energy back into yourself. A lot of, a lot of you guys don't even have the fucking time. I ain't even going to lie. A lot of you guys don't even have the time for love right now. <laughs> love where i'm hearing i can't even get a day off <laughs> i can't even fucking get a day off about love but um that's because a lot of you guys have been hurt in the past a lot of you guys are still healing a lot of you guys need to do some healing some um healing work on some things that people have done to you but you guys are looking great good you're standing in your confidence you're looking good you're feeling good you're looking amazing yes like i told you people are watching you virgo let them watch give them something to Give, look sexy look sexy you know what i'm saying feel good whatever you're taking this page of wands you're feeling free a lot of you guys don't have necessarily any burdens right now when it comes to love a lot of you guys have got the love in reverse a lot of you guys are either healing from a past relationship or you have left a relationship but love is not on the forefront for you guys now this is for some of you take it how it resonates for you i've got the queen of cups in reverse which tells me like i said going back thank you spirit for clarifying telling me that you know when it comes to love right now that is not your main priority a lot 
lot of you guys have been hurt. The chariot is in reverse, which tells me there's no movement for, forward. If you got some, a lot of you guys want love though. You want stability. You want commitment. Some of you guys that I'm picking up right now are feeling like, how the fuck am I going to have that right now when I'm so busy? I got a business to run. I ain't got time for love right now. But I feel like a lot of you guys are blocking out that love. You're not allowing people to come towards you because you've got the chariot in reverse. You've got the queen of cups in reverse. It tells me a lot of you guys are quite insecure right now when it comes to love and relationships. Or you could be in a long commitment. Sorry that I'm talking fast. I'm just channeling. Some of you guys could be in a long commitment right now and you could be feeling insecure in that relationship. You may, may not be feeling supported by that partner or that partner could be a karmic. Um, be careful of karmic partners in this time. You have blessings coming towards you and people can see that people can pick up on that energy people can see how hard you're working like i said people are watching you so um also be careful you're not blocking your blessings right now when it comes to love if that's something that you want manifest it and be open to it also heal those childhood wounds a lot of you guys may have suffered from abuse in the past from partners um take that how it resonates for you um go to counseling if needed talk to friends talk to family members people that you can trust but try and go through that healing journey take some time away a lot of you guys need a holiday somewhere nice where there's a blue sea somewhere that's hot i'm getting egypt oh, turkey judgment has been called okay so whatever happened in your past judgment has been called let me tell you something virgos huh, god is with you right now oh i got the chills god's with you right now god is with your spirit guides are with you right now oh i feel i feel emotional oh virgos you guys are fucking amazing you know you guys are amazing People don't understand how amazing you guys are. Nine of Pentacles, right? And you're about to be rich. If you're not rich already, you're at this Nine of Pentacles, baby. Look how happy she looks. Let your hair out. Look at that. Some of you guys may have a lovely curly fro. You may have curly hair, big curly hair. Let it out, baby. Time for you to shine. Um, I'm also picking up, stay out, um, calm down on the heat. As, as in for your hair, a few of you guys have been straightening your hair uh quite a bit or using um chemicals or products on your hair um i'm i don't know why i'm picking this up this is for somebody but um let your your curls let your get your curl pattern back what the fuck was that but get your thanks spirit if someone needs to hear that get your curl pattern back um go outside talk to animals you know uh, get in nature, go have a picnic, spend some time with family and friends, but really importantly, Virgo, spend some time with yourself, okay? Anything else that we need to know about Virgo when it comes to love? A lot of you guys are blocking love out, though. A lot of you guys aren't even bloody thinking about it. I don't blame you. You know, like I said, a lot of you guys need that healing work. You need to go through that healing. A lot of you guys are just burying it. I'm getting burying it down.